5 Great Ways to Boost Your High Now, before we go any further, no, the solution to boosting your high is not to smoke more weed. That's not really the point of this video. Instead, we want to show you ways you can improve your high without using more cannabis. And believe us when we say you can. First off, have you considered changing the strain of the cannabis you smoke? We ask because it's easy for the body to become accustomed to and more tolerant of cannabis if you use the same strain all the time. The result can often mean smoking more cannabis to get the same result, let alone any possibility of a boost. Have you also considered how to use cannabis? Maybe you'd get a better high from some edibles. Better still, either before or after you smoke or before you have some edibles, try a few slices of mango. Yes, seriously, because mango contains what is known as myrcene. Myrcene is a terpene, and terpenes are renowned for entering into the bloodstream seriously quickly. And when they do, they will react with any THC that is there, resulting in a longer-lasting or more intense high. Now, here's a thought. You know we mentioned about becoming tolerant to cannabis above. Well, did you know that if you don't use cannabis roughly for a fortnight, that tolerance diminishes by up to a half? Now, don't scream at us for this suggestion, but if you avoid cannabis for a month, clinical trials have shown that your tolerance levels would have reverted back to normal. But hey, it'll just be like starting over again with your first ever joint. Finally, and the one we like the least, is to do more exercise and eat a little less. Now, this may sound like the standard spiel for a diet, and you'd be right. However, the weight loss here is just a consequence of what you're actually trying to achieve. You see, THC is stored in body fat, and burning off body fat will release the THC into your system. So, after an extensive workout, you should get a better high from a joint, especially when you add it to all the endorphins that your body is also releasing. We would add that going on any form of diet or starting an exercise regime should never be done without consulting a dietitian or your GP. However, we're not sure if you should tell them why you want to lose weight. And finally, yes, you can smoke more weed, but why not try some of the above first? Let us know in the comments how you go about increasing your high. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe so you too can become a cannabis expert.